how are you? Happy Thursday. I love holding space for you every single week here in the cloud. I hope you all had a amazing Christmas and that everybody loved their oily gifts. I love seeing all of you jumping in. Carolina's here and Christy's here and Kathy's here and Jay is here. Hello, everybody. Hello, hello. Happy Thursday. Hi, Holly. Hi, Mom. Let me know where you are watching from in the comments if you like. Hello, Drew. Hello, Beth. Hello, Lori. Hello, Cecilia. Hello, Callie. Hello, Angela. Hello, Kelly. I am drinking a celebratory magnesium mocktail because I am so grateful for all of you that we made it to this day. Hello. Hi, Olivia. Hello from Memphis. Hello from the couch. Oh, Cecilia's in Utah. Hi, Colleen. Hello, Helen. It is time to slay, slay, slay. Thank you. Yes, I am loving my mug. Drew and Kelly, thank you so much for that. You'll have to tell me your name if you have a fancy screen name and I don't know it. If this is your first time joining me, you are in for a treat. Uh, and my name is Hilary LeMay and I'm your Throw It Out Thursday label reading gangster hostess, essential oil educator, platinum global team leader, and I'm an AromaTouch certif certified practitioner and I just completed 100 Aroma Touch treatments. So I thought I would wear my little Aroma Touch technique apron that I got from convention that if you did not snag one, hopefully they will offer them later another day. Hi, Mariah. Oh, thank you for joining. Yes, yes, yes. It is three years. We're saying cheers to three years. Holy cow. Mm. Since December 31st, 2015, we've met together here to get chemicals in to kick chemicals to the curb in the cloud wherever we are and whether you're watching the replay or you're watching live it is all good and tonight we are celebrating that we are celebrating three years of my very first periscope and it is hard to believe that I've been sharing doTERRA since 2014 but that since 2015 I decided that I really wanted to bring my recipes my favorite ideas and my favorite life hacks hello Melanie to life here in this live media platform. Um, I had so many little amazing nuggets and ideas and things that I wanted to do and this has just become such an amazing opportunity for me to connect with you all and share and it's been so awesome. Hi Stacy. hello. I hope there's a baby coming soon <laughs> but there's lots of periscopes to catch up on in the meantime if you need something to do between now and when baby comes. And I just, we have covered so much ground together. It is hard to believe really sometimes. And so back in 2014, when Periscope first came out, uh, this was long before Facebook Live and any of those other live media platforms. Um, there were lots of big doTERRA leaders jumping in here and sharing and just chatting about the business, but I didn't really see anyone sharing recipes or demonstrations. It was more just chit chatting and talking, which is great of course, and we have to do that to lay the groundwork. But I just felt like something was sparked in my soul. I felt like there was a need that was not being filled for someone to be here sharing recipes, sharing practical information on how to use oils. And I knew I had information to share. I knew I had a passion to share and I felt something calling me, but limiting beliefs that I had about myself and you know, just my knowledge about oils in general prevented me from doing that for a really long time. And something clicked and I just felt like, why not me? You know, cause I would look at them and say, oh, you know, I couldn't do that. I, I can't do that. I'm, I'm not, I'm not this, that, the other, all these limiting beliefs. And then I just decided, why not me? I'm gonna do it, sure, let's do this. And so I made my New Year's resolution for 2016 to just dip my toe into Periscope and into the live media platform, just doing demonstrations and bringing my oil recipes to life for my oilers and figuring if anyone else out there wanted the information, you know, it would be there on YouTube, archived and, and whatnot. And I had no idea how tremendous this would become. And because I'm such an activator, if you've ever taken the Clifton Strengths Finder, you know that, um, I didn't wanna wait till the new year began. I, saw, I thought to myself, why wait? 
why wait until the first? Why not start now? So um, on New Year's Eve 2015, George was working um, the night shift so he wasn't home and Olivia was asleep and I just decided, you know what? I am gonna do my first broadcast tonight. And so I shared it on, on Instagram and Facebook and my oil team and everything that, you know, join me if you're not going out or before you go out. And I'm gonna show you how to do charcoal brushing with activated charcoal and spearmint essential oil. And you can have a nice fresh kiss for New Year's Eve. And just kind of how to kick toxic, expensive uh, teeth whitener strips to the curb. And I had so much fun. I was super nervous and I'm still nervous every single Thursday, but it's less fear and more excitement, honestly, because I'm just so thrilled to be here and share this information with you. And spitting black into a cup and brushing my teeth on live media, you know, I was terrified, but I felt the fear and I did it anyway. And as you can see, if you've been here for a while, it's been such a tremendously life-changing experience for me. When I look back at my earlier periscopes, I can physically see my transformation. It's kind of amazing and it's really fun because I can teach my oil team, I do hard things and you can do hard things too. And you can watch me on screen do hard things and be embarrassed and we keep going anyway. And that's the joy because nobody's perfect and that's not what we're shooting for. We're sharing and that's not about perfection. It's about showing up and consistency and showing your true authentic self and you can never be wrong when you do that. Hey Laura, hello. And I've met so many of you at doTERRA events. I've become lifelong friends with so many of you. I've expanded my oil team all over the world because of this platform. And just thank you so much from me to you. Thank you so much for sharing this joy with me every single week. Hello, hello everybody, yes. I am so grateful to be able to have this platform to share with you. And it has been such a joy. We've been going through the years, having fun learning about how those small sustainable changes that we make, that we stick with, can truly improve our daily lives, improve our mindfulness, and just really encourage us to work together, right? Because even if you're not on my oil team, you can feel excited, you can feel encouraged, you can feel like you know exactly how to use your oils and feel really comfortable doing that. And so hopefully by showing up for you consistently, you felt inspired to use your oils consistently to help your family, to share with your friends and beyond, and you've invested money in your oils and I want you to feel comfortable using them. And so speaking of consistency, last fall after getting Aroma Touch certified with some of my oilers back in 2017, so I don't know if you can see that here, but back in 2017, uh, in November, I got Aroma Touch certified, and of course, I love rocking the apron because it's just so fun. <laughs> oh, thank you, Beth. I'm so grateful that you guys are enjoying these. It is so fun for me and such a special day. Oh, yes. Of course, we have to talk about the nails because non-toxic beauty products is such a perfect complement to the work we do with oils. So today's uh, Zoya of the week is Rocky and then a coat of rain with a Y over it because she's shimmery and it's perfect for Aroma Touch colors, right? She matches my Aroma Touch apron. And I just, I love showing you the consistency. And so speaking of that, after I got Aroma Touch certified back in November, 2017, I made a New Year's resolution for 2018. And I said, you know what? I truly love the idea of the consistency and of the accountability of creating these resolutions that I am gonna hold myself accountable to. And that these, resolutions bless other people along the way and it's a lot easier to stick with something when you know that there's other people counting on you and and relying on that and so i decided that i was gonna uh gift a hundred aroma touch treatments in 2018 and as of this morning i completed that and i feel so proud of myself that i stuck to that and that there you you aren't giving someone an aroma touch for money that it is not meant for monetary exchange in fact if you look in the details in the aroma touch training manual that you receive when you attend the training it clearly specifies this is not intended for monetary exchange it's just an opportunity for you to connect and share oils and give people an experience with oils so like we teach classes and we teach people about oils it's amazing, hello Amanda. Uh, it's amazing to be able to give someone an oil experience. So if anyone's ever put a wild orange and peppermint in your hand and you warm it up and you breathe it in, 
that's an experience. And when someone does an aroma touch treatment on you, it's an experience and it's an amazing experience. And I thought how cool and how special this would be that I would get to bless the people in my life. And through this gift, I have been able to reconnect with childhood friends, people who came to visit, family members, friends, oilers in my local area. It's truly just the beginning because I'm not stopping here. This doesn't mean that I'm not gonna be doing aroma touch anymore. I love welcoming my new oilers and my oil team and everyone around me, my neighbors, friends and family to have an aroma touch treatment it is such an amazing experience and again there's no cost for aroma touch anyone can attend an aroma touch training and learn actually you don't even need to be a doTERRA customer if you want to attend a training you just pay and you sign up and there are aroma touch training opportunities all over the world so I encourage you to reach out to whoever brought you to doTERRA or oils and if you have not joined yet I would love to be that lighthouse for you you can reach out to me and I can set you up with a couple trainers in your area and they can plug you into their next couple training sessions that they have planned and so it's just an amazing opportunity to share oils with people and how funny um, for those of you that are doTERRA customers you probably received your winter magazine either today or yesterday or maybe you will receive it in the next couple days and how funny that on page 18 is this really cool aroma touch quiz and it's got all the eight aroma touch oils and a little uh, some fun facts about each one and you can go online to the link it provides and you can take a little quiz and see which oil personality is yours so like for balance um, you're the calming presence for lavender you're the one who's laid back and has a go with the flow attitude for melaleuca you're always the one with something to say so this is really fun so if you guys get a chance after the scope don't leave now <laughs> we still have a lot of fun to have together um, but if you get a chance I would love for you to message me or share with me um, on social media your oil personality from the aroma touch 8 because I think this is really fun and cool so I love um, just digging into the technique and sharing it with you and, and I think you're gonna really enjoy this and seeing my goals materialize is just one of my favorite things and I love sharing that with you and I love celebrating my own personal milestones and sharing that and I love celebrating the milestones of others so if you have a milestone that you have worked on and worked really hard for share it with me tag me on Instagram or Facebook share it with me I would love to celebrate you and just be excited for you because life is so short and it's really an, an uh, something that's just important to me as well is to acknowledge those things because people really appreciate that affirmation and it's really special. Hello, Pebby. Oh, hello from San Diego with Caden as well. Thank you for joining me. And so my broadcast tonight is going to feature something. Um, CC, yes, they still send those out. Um, if you are doing your LRP, then you should get one, but if not, you can go to the uh, to your doTERRA.com portal and you can download the content for free so um, send me a message and I will send you the link to um, view the virtual catalog but we can al also reach out to doTERRA and make sure that you get on the mailing list for that so my broadcast tonight is gonna feature something that has been by request by many of my aroma touch clients that have come this year and of course this platform of Periscope allows me to share my passion for doTERRA essential oils with you and my love for this wellness lifestyle and really just the freedom the freedom to create whatever we want together and share in this wellness lifestyle together oh hello McKinley she's here for the first time with Aunt Hillary I love you McKinley mwah, mwah. from Virginia to Washington you are the cutest little member of our oil squad and we're so glad to have you welcome to the outside world <laughs> and you know maybe whoever brought you to doTERRA isn't as enthusiastic as we are maybe they're not tossing glitter bombs like we are maybe they are either way regardless of all of that I hope you'll stay now that you found me and so many of us are providing free education and content for you so seek those of us out that you resonate with online and know that you can always bloom where you're planted and you don't need to have you know a particular oil leader here or there that you might see you can be that own lighthouse for you I promise I did it and you can totally do that too so this is just a safe collective for everyone to come from all over the world for continued education and for fun with me. And if you're just joining, I am drinking my celebratory magnesium mocktail and saying cheers to three years. Hello, Sandy. 
And this is just our little cozy nook of the interweb. So after watching my broadcasts, if you are new, I hope that it will show you that oils don't have to be intimidating, that they are fun, that it's a choose your own adventure all the time, and they can really help you practice mindfulness, practice more self-care, and help improve your wellness and everything in between. Thank you, yes, cheers. Mm. And so if you would like to share this, you can click the three little buttons at the bottom and you can share this across your media platforms, Facebook and Twitter, and on Periscope, of course, too. And then you can earn an extra entry into tonight's final giveaway of 2018. I am giving away an entire Aroma Touch kit. Hello, Melody. OMG, this kit is the boss. This is going to have all eight oils we're gonna talk about tonight, plus a bottle of fractionated coconut oil, because I love y'all more than I love my oils themselves, and I cannot wait to bless one of you. So if you win, please message me your snail mail address because I will get it out for you ASAP in the morning. And I don't know that you'll get it by um, Monday because I think there's mail service on Monday the 31st, but Tuesday's the first of the month. So if I can get this to you before the first, I would really love to do that. So if you win, um, you'll know because I'll share your information and tag you on Instagram at 11 o'clock tonight or before. And I would love for you to win. So all you need to do is make sure that you head over to my Instagram page and comment on my post from this morning with your favorite Periscope of either 2017 or 2018 or 2016. Any of your favorite Periscope, let me know what your favorite broadcast has been and then the winner will be posted at 11 o'clock. So I'm really excited to bless you guys so much because it just makes my heart happy, you know, and it's something was left over from Santa's sleigh, you know, so I'm, I'm making sure that we bring those little gifties to you. And that way, if you're not sure about the technique, you can have all the oils at your fingertips and you can have the resources I'm gonna talk about tonight and you'll be able to do that because anyone can perform an aroma touch treatment on anyone. You don't have to attend the training. You can totally learn easily with some of the resources we're gonna talk about. And then of course, you can show me love by tapping the screen as many times as you want at the bottom and that just sends me a heart and lets me know that you're having fun along with me and we're kicking chemicals to the curb together and we're having a blast. And so if you miss anything, you can go to YouTube, you can go to my Periscope recent section and if you're joining for the first time, you have a lot of catching up to do, but don't let that intimidate you. You can oil up and just start somewhere <laughs> because the last 178 broadcasts are calling your name. So maybe you're taking a transatlantic flight anytime soon and you'll have lots of things to do. So so I would love for you to put up a one if you've ever been curious about what the Aroma Touch treatment is all about, and then put up a two if you have plans to attend an Aroma Touch training in the future or you are already Aroma Touch certified. And in honor of my third Periscope anniversary, which we're gonna take another sip of my magnesium mocktail because I'm still just as nervous as I was the first day. I hate to break it to you because maybe some of you think it gets easier. It doesn't really. <laughs> Still nervous, but still showing up for you anyway. So um, in honor of my third Periscope anniversary, we're gonna talk about something that I have spent the entire year holding space for, and it is going to be awesome, and it's all about the Aroma Touch technique. So the first thing we're gonna talk about is what is the Aroma Touch technique, right? We're gonna do a little crash course because we need to know what it's all about and lay that groundwork. The second is I am gonna blend for you something that has been so requested. It's a Zenden perfume. Because when you leave whatever room that you're having an aroma touch treatment in, which we set aside an entire room in our home, it's our workout room slash Zenden. And yes, Drew and Kelly, you are super duper aroma touch certified. Uh, we created a room for the aroma touch treatments and we call it the Zenden. And there's a sign up outside the door that says the Zenden. So you'll never get lost. You'll know exactly where to go when you need Zen. But when you're done having an aroma touch treatment, it just smells so incredible in the room and it's just these good vibes and I love being in that room because it reminds me of all the healing that's taken place, not only for me, because I get to be blessed by the oils when I'm giving an aroma touch treatment. So it actually is an immune booster for me, it's an emotional booster for me, it's an anti-inflammatory booster for me. Uh, it is awesome, right? So everybody wins, but everybody loves the smell of the Zenden and how you feel afterward and when you get in your car and you smell yourself and you smell all these oils, you're like, I smell good. Oh, that's good. And you smell it in your hair, you smell it in your clothes. And if you um, 
yeah, I mean, it's just awesome. And so everybody asks for an Aroma Touch perfume. They're like, oh, we should make a perfume that smells like Aroma Touch. And I'm like, okay, let's do it. So tonight we're gonna do it. And I've been waiting to do this until it was 100 Aroma Touches complete day. And that day is today. So that's what we're gonna do. And then lastly, I'm gonna close up with an update on my broadcast schedule for 2019. So we're gonna dig in because we have a lot to talk about tonight. So what is the Aroma Touch all about? So if you're not familiar with it, it is also called the Oil Touch Technique and it's outlined in pages 19 through 21 in your Essential Life book. So if you do not have this Essential Life book, I highly recommend it. This is the fifth edition and it just came out uh, recently and it has all the new oils from this year at convention and this is something that I gift all of my new oilers when they get started with me because it is extremely important for me that my oilers have education support leadership tools open communication but especially the fact that they can be empowered on their own so if it's 2 a.m and their kiddo has a fever or if it's midnight and you know their kiddo is throwing up and they don't know what to do they don't have to try to get in touch with me because my phone's on airplane mode when i sleep and if yours isn't you should turn it on airplane mode too when you sleep um and so I love having this resource for people. And so if you go to pages 19 and 21, you can actually teach yourself how to do the oil touch technique, the aroma touch technique, and you don't have to attend a class. Now granted, there's a lot of extra information that you learn when you attend the class, and I definitely recommend you attend the class, and anyone can attend. So you don't have to be a customer, you don't have to be a business builder, um, anyone that wants to attend is able to but the oil touch technique is outlined in pages 19, 20, and 21 in detail with every single step <clears throat> detailed for you. So if you need a little refresher course on the Aroma Touch technique, I highly recommend that you check out these pages and try it out. I love this. And then if you are on my oil team and you are newer, um, I recorded an entire Aroma Touch technique with Patty um, while she was pregnant with twins. I have a pregnancy pillow that we use for any pregnant people that want to come and have an aroma touch. And I recorded it. So we're not allowed to share that obviously because it's proprietary, but if you are on my oil team, let me know and I will tag you in the post in our private team page where you can watch it from start to finish. And I actually narrated the entire way through. So I tell you exactly what steps to do and exactly which oils to use and all of that. So that is a great team perk for you if you are in the oil squad. And so the essential life book has all that detailed. When you take the training, you will get the training manual and it has all the detailed instructions as well. Um, Helen, yes, it is such a great book. And it has all the details about each of the oils in here. It has information on each of the steps and the techniques that you use for applying each of the oils. And so I think you're gonna really love the training when you take it. And again, you can find the training anywhere in the world. There are certified Aroma Touch trainers available for you. And in the beginning when I first started, I used a cheat sheet and I just laminated this and I kept it in the Zen Den for me to refer refer to and um, I found that really helpful because it kind of told you exactly which steps and which motions that you use with each oil and this is really really helpful so if you just got the training I highly recommend that you make a little cheat sheet for yourself but in a nutshell the aroma touch is a light touch clinical application technique of where you are using a sequence of eight oils directly to the body in certain movements and again that's why when you purchase the aroma touch kit you can get this in your back office even if you are not a new oiler so anyone can purchase a complete aroma touch kit if you want to have that or you can purchase the oils individually of course but if you want to get started and you want all these together doTERRA does offer uh, a starter kit where you get a year of access with 25% off your account and all that so reach out to me if you want to learn more and we can chat about that so um, again I printed the cheat sheet and that really helped me and now it's just like riding a bike um, you can use fractionated coconut oil it's really not recommended um, for like for really using in large quantities only on the feet really if the feet end up being a little bit dry but if you need to use this like massage oil you're pushing and pressing too hard it's not meant to be like a massage where you're actually like manipulating the skin and digging in it's really meant to be very light and you don't want to do it 
to the point where you're pressing deep and that you are feeling like friction that you need massage oil. You really don't need fractionated coconut oil. That's only intended for folks that might have sensitive skin. And um, when it comes to that, what I have done, because I've been doing this so many times this year, I came up with some life hacks that really helped me. And in this really cute little pink fox bag, I've got my Aroma Touch kit of rollers that I made using the root and petal roller bottles from my friend Becky at the Root and Petal, and they're all color coded based on all of the oils in the Aroma Touch technique. And I keep these up in the Zen Den in one of the drawers. And so when I give Olivia an Aroma Touch, I use the diluted rollers um, because I find that, especially for people that have sensitive skin or for young kids, this is a better option instead of having to pull out the fractionated coconut oil for every oil and everything. It's just, for me, it streamlines the process. So I like to have this set of pre made rollers all ready to go in the space that I'm doing the Aroma Touch in. That just really helps me and I just, I love it so much. So uh, I would highly encourage everyone who's using oils, everyone that's watching this to attend an Aroma Touch training and um, see if you can work with someone in your area, whether it's the person that brought you to doTERRA or a local friend that is Aroma Touch trained. I would love for you to experience the Aroma Touch technique because it's great and it's so informative. The training's informative, it's educational, and by the end you get to perform an Aroma Touch treatment on someone, and then you get to have you get to be the recipient of an Aroma Touch technique, and it helps bring the body to a healing state. So if you've not experienced it, I highly recommend doing that. If you have been certified, I recommend finding someone in your area that you can do an Aroma Touch swap. And I'm so blessed by Beth if she's still on here. She she also got certified and she and I will trade Aroma Touch, Symphony of the Cells, and it's a really great opportunity for you to bless others with you. It is so special. Now, Stacy, that is actually on my list for 2019, so I've put myself in the queue. Um, when you want to become an Aroma Touch certified trainer, you have to be at least gold rank in doTERRA as a leader, and you have to complete 30 aroma touches, which I've done more than that, um, but you have to get in the queue because Dr. Hill only does a certain number of certifications per year. So I'm just waiting for them to call me and then I either fly out to Utah or one of the locations that they have not announced yet for 2019, but I am really excited to become an aroma touch certified trainer so that I can certify my oil team here so that no longer do we have to wait for anyone else's schedule that we can certify the team at my home and on our schedule and it's going to be so exciting so that is something that I'm holding space for and manifesting that Dr. Hill has enough uh, slots available for me to do that and uh, I'm super excited and hopefully Dr. Laura and I will get to experience that together um, and it is just such an awesome thing I, I love I love this so much so this is something that we are striving for in all of our lives, right? When the body is healthy, it's achieving a balance. And so when we are unhealthy, when we feel under the weather or fatigued or tired, our body is not in balance and we can feel that and we know that. And when we're in our zone of genius and we're feeling energized and focused and good, we know our health is in balance, right? And that's something really important. And so yes, Olivia, I am so excited to become a, an Aroma Touch instructor. I'm really excited for that. I'll probably host two or three trainings a year. So I will make that available for my oilers locally and then I will probably open it up to others um, because you know I wanna make sure that we're maximizing our time and we'll probably keep it to 20 people or 20, probably 20 people or less just to make sure everyone gets an amazing experience but the last time we hosted a class at my house um, Kelly was our instructor and we set up three massage tables um, one in the main living room one in Olivia's playroom and then one or one in the like dining room area one in the living room and one in Olivia's playroom and I think we have room for two other tables in our front room so I'm excited for that that's to come in 2019 so um, hopefully we can manifest that together and that will happen and so something that we're striving for is balance in the body. And so balancing our body's health can be interrupted by stress. Balancing our body's health can be interrupted by environmental toxins, which is why we kick chemicals to the curb together every week, which is why we try to be mindful of those stressors in our lives and practice more self-care, which doesn't necessarily mean going for a spa day. It can mean painting your nails and having some magnesium tea. It could mean taking a bath with your favorite oils. 
can mean reading a book or listening to a podcast or doing something, taking a walk with a friend and getting fresh air. <clears throat> but maintaining the body's balance can also be uh, can can also be interrupted by trauma. And so the aroma touch technique promotes bringing the body back to a balanced state so that healing can continue. Because right, when we're in that zone of genius, we're feeling focused and energized, we're creating, we're feeling great, that's when the magic happens. That's when our body heals, right? We heal by having fun, by laughing, by having a good time. And we can't do those things if we're sick. We, we do those things when our body is in balance. And so um, I recommend that you do this or that you have this done to you as regularly as you possibly can as part of your wellness plan and part of your prevention and your habit architecture, which means the things that you do on a regular basis. And again, like I showed you, we make pre-made rollers so that whenever Olivia asks for an aroma touch, I've got those rollers in the drawer in the Zen Den and we're ready to go. And if anyone comes to our home and schedules an aroma touch with me and they mention that they have sensitive skin, I will use those rollers instead. And so instead of dropping the oils on, I will just kind of go up the spine in circular motions. Now I also love streamlining, you know that about me. I love strategic and maximizer are like two of my top five Clifton strengths. And I talk about them a lot because I think they're really amazing to um, live your strengths, right? Because it helps you really know where your drive and motivation comes from. But anyway, I love streamlining things and so I'm gonna show you this cool little thing that I got from convention. You can do this with any of your keychains that you can get from your back office or from any of the oil sharing websites. And this is an Aroma Touch keychain. And so it's got eight spots for drams. And what I love about this so much, and look at, this has got my balance oil in there, right? And so. Regardless of whether you're doing an aroma touch on the go or not, these oils can pretty much cover all your bases, right? So if you are feeling stressed out, you can use balance and lavender because those support your stress. And if you are feeling yucky or under the weather or sick people are around you, you can take some Melaleuca and On Guard and you know, um, warm it up between your hands and clean your hands. If you're feeling head tension or really painful anywhere, you can grab Aroma Touch and Deep Blue and put those on your temples, your pulse points, anywhere you need support there. And if you're feeling tired and lethargic and just blah, you can grab your Wild Orange and Peppermint. And so these eight are such essentials and I love being able to have them in a little zipper case with a little carabiner that you can pop onto your purse. You can put this in your backpack. You can put this in your diaper bag. So you will have this on the go. And again, if you didn't get one of these at convention or if you weren't able to attend convention, that's no problem. You can get these at any of the outfitters that you purchase oil supplies from. So I really love this. Um, you're gonna be ready for any oil emergency that comes. I get about 80 drops of each oil in the little drams. And again, they can pretty much accomplish anything. And and um, I also love to streamline with the flip caps from gotoilsupplies.com. And so this is the set that I keep in the Zen Den and I keep it in this little acrylic lip gloss or lipstick or cosmetic holder that I got on Amazon. And I love that because the oils that are in the Aroma Touch technique are in five ml bottles. So they're very easy to travel with and um, I just love these. And this is really fun and this is a great way for you to maximize when you're doing the aroma touch. So when you are doing an aroma touch, you want to have one hand on the recipient at all times because you don't want to break contact with them because you're creating a bond and there's energy flow there and healing energy. And so you want to keep a hand on them at all times. So being able to use the flip caps makes it super simple for you when you're doing this because you can just flip it open with your thumb and flip it closed with your finger. When you apply the oils, you can put it right back in and then you can move forward with the steps that you're doing and so I keep this within arm's reach of me when I am doing an aroma touch treatment however you can use your aroma touch apron if you want and you can put the oils in here um, I found that that doesn't work as well for me because when I'm reaching over and doing you know different motions I don't want the oils to maybe touch their head or forehead or side of their body and create pressure um, but I love the I love the apron for you know if I'm um, working on any projects or any DIYs and I need to have oils with me and I'm doing anything like that. So, uh, you know, just choose your own adventure when it comes to that. But just like we stretch, exercise, take our vitamins and drink our magnesium, it is 
so important to use our oils and this is a great practice for you to get into this is a clinical way to use oils and get that habit architecture going the way that your days are made up right so every day we want to be using our oils and you can start to see why i wanted to implement this as a regular practice in my home this year because we all need more balance we all are working too hard and we're spread too thin and we want to be able to maintain that balance in our lives and so i'm going to give you an example that the book uses so the balance in your body looks like a series of connected seesaws right so when you go down the other side goes up and when this side goes down the other side goes up and this is how a seesaw works if you have kiddos you know this because you know you go to the playground and consider the process of standing up in order for you to stand and walk your body needs to maintain a delicate balance between falling forward and falling backward and so just like leaning too much to either side may make you fall over your body inside is maintaining a similar delicate balance and so your nervous system for example is either in a stress state hi robin um, your nervous system is either in a stress state or in a rested state and both sides cannot be up at the same time so your immune system is the same your immune system is going to nervous the is going to mirror the nervous system's actions so if your immune system is not in balance then your nervous system is not going to be in balance either and so your body is either moving infection out of your body or it is pushing infection deeper into your body to deal with later and so aroma touch can help restore this balance like rebooting your computer like a little control alt delete for optimal functioning and for homeostasis for your body so the step one the the movements that you use in step one of the aroma touch treatment shift the body in and shift the nervous system from a stress state to a rest state and that is really critical for you to absolutely enjoy the experience at all right you're establishing that connection with the person you're giving the aroma touch to and you're shifting the body from a nervous state from a stress state to a rested state and then step two and the motions that you use in step two and the oils you use in step two are encouraging the body to move from the secondary immune system to the primary immune system and then the movements in step three and the oils in step three are reducing pain and reducing inflammation and then lastly step four the movements you're using in step four and the oils you're using in step four are shifting the body back to a balanced state so control alt delete just like our computer <laughs> uh, you do not speak during the aroma touch pebby that is a great question and if you guys have questions let me know i'll ask at the end but you can absolutely jump in with questions anytime i do not speak at all during aroma touch when someone comes for their very first time um, i have the diffuser going now i have the humidifier going because as we talked about in one of the youtube series that i did with sandy from stadler having the optimal humidity level is actually really important for your body's healing so um, <clears throat> I don't speak at all I just say if you need something or you need to you know say something let me know but I do not speak during the aroma touch technique so they come in and I give them an opportunity to take off their clothing from the waist up and give them privacy so I just let them know you know please come and lay face down with everything off from the waist up on the massage table and then cover yourself with the blanket and I have a heated blanket uh, underneath the massage table so it's nice and warm and it's gonna help your body just sort of warm up and receive those oils and it the, the heat also relaxes you a little bit um, but I also have a ceiling fan so I let them know if you're getting warm let me know and I can turn down the heat uh, and I have really nice calming music on that doesn't have words it's very spa zen like I have a Himalayan salt lamp as well going and then I step out of the room for about five minutes and then I knock gently and just let them know you know is it okay to come in and then they are covered so there's modesty you know and you're not exposed or anything like that um, but I do not speak during the aroma touch it is really important to me that this person not be thinking about what I'm saying or not thinking about what they need to say but I just ask them to focus on their breathing and just really let their mind go wherever it wants to go naturally but focus on your breathing we're not going to speak and then at the end if they have questions or if they 
um, you know, want to talk about their experience, you know, obviously we do, but I do not speak during the Aroma Touch technique. Drew, I actually use music from Amazon Music, so I have um, some Zen playlists that kind of automatically queue up, um, and I really like that because the music is just instrumental and it's not anything with words. So um, during the entire process, as the technique progresses, the therapeutic benefits compound and all three of these areas, emotions, immune response, and pain are just being washed away and supported. And the training manual and the Essential Life book outline all the steps and all the techniques and all the information that you need. So whether you've attended a training or not, you can still feel empowered that you can totally do this. And so now that we have all the tools, how can we combine them for a fun, amazing craft, right? And now I also give them water. So I have alkaline water that we drink in our home and I make sure that I give everybody water and I'd like them, I encourage them to drink beforehand, but also encourage them to drink water afterward because as you know, your body's um, going through these different stages, you want to make sure that you're staying hydrated as always. So we're going to make our DIY Zen Den perfume because when everyone leaves the Zen Den and they love the way they smell and they want to keep that smell going and they want to feel that emotional support, it's like when I smell those oils, my brain is familiar. My brain knows that that's relaxed time. And like I said, it is such a blessing for me too. When I give the Aroma Touch treatment, I am feeling so relaxed as well because there's nothing else I'm focused on. I can't multitask. I am completely unplugged and it feels so good. Melody, the Aroma Touch treatments are usually anywhere between 25 and 30 minutes. Um, I feel very comfortable doing it and so it's very streamlined and I don't have to take a break to you know, refresh my memory on the steps. It's very fluid that I can go right into each each phase quickly um, and you don't want to go too slow because when you're applying the oils they're absorbed into your body so quickly that you do want to have a good uh, cadence that you're using to apply the oil so Melody you'll have to uh, message me some dates and we'll have to get you into the Zen Den for an aroma touch so uh, again everyone that comes to the Zen Den they just they love the way they feel and I always check in with them and I ask them how do they feel I ask them how did they sleep um, the night before. I check in with them the next day and typically people sleep incredibly well, their bodies in balance and disturbances that they might be feeling are worked through. And some people com will constantly comment and say how good they smell afterward and that they didn't want to take a shower because they didn't want to wipe the oils off so they waited to take a shower until the morning and then they still felt sad because they wanted to keep that smell going. And so I'm like, well, why not make your own body mist with the Aroma Touch oils, right? You can smell like the Zen Den any time you want to. <laughs> so I started picking up on this trend and of course, when there's an opportunity to do a fun DIY together, I'm gonna snatch that up. So we make dreams come true here in the Zen Den and so we are gonna make an Aroma Touch perfume for you. And since you don't want to diffuse blends with uh, fractionated coconut oil and that includes the oil blend balance, which is the first oil you use in the Aroma Touch technique. If you want to make an Aroma Touch diffuser blend, you can either use the Leah diffuser that I showed last week from Stadler, um, which is not, it doesn't use water, so you can either do that or you can just omit the balance oil and maybe just use oils that are in the balance blend. So choose your own adventure. I just don't recommend that anyone diffuse oils with fractionated coconut oil because it will ruin your machine. So. Um, I, I just take any perfume bottle. This is a little bottle that I got on Amazon. Uh, it came in a set of four or six, I think. You can use whatever you have, an empty spray bottle. You can even use your spray bottles from, uh, from the Root and Petal also. You can make a room mist if you don't wanna have it just as a perfume, um, but you can get these spray bottles from the Root and Petal as well as the roller bottles. So you can just choose your own adventure. Exactly, Laura, real friends do not let you diffuse blends with fractionated coconut oil. We just don't do it to you. So you can take any perfume bottle that you like, and this is very unisex. So what I do is just twist off the spray nozzle like so, and just set this down. And then you're gonna just simply take 10 drops of each of your oils and you're gonna blend that and then we're gonna add water. You can add witch hazel or you can add water and then we have our own Aroma Touch perfume and you can smell like Aroma Touch any day of the week and it's gonna be amazing, right? It already is amazing. So I'm gonna have another sip of my celebratory cheers to three years magnesium mocktail. And then first we're gonna use 
balance. So balance is step one in the Aroma Touch technique. We're gonna add 10 drops of balance to our blend. And shout out to Elka from Share Oils because she makes dreams come true with dropper bottles and with ring labels. What? Mind blown. This year is a year of transformation and uh, streamlining our processes, right? And so when we use dropper tops, we do not spill our oils as easily as if we use our oils directly from the bottle. So I love making sure that I am streamlining my crafts. So we're going to use 10 drops from here. One, two, three, four. All right. So we've got 10 drops of balance. Yes, we love you, Elka. We love you forever and a day. And so balance is the first oil that you're going to use in the Aroma Touch technique at my apron and this is going to create a sense of calm and well-being and this also creates a nice initial bond between the person giving the treatment and the person on the massage table and this blend has spruce and frankincense and blue tansy and chamomile and fractionated coconut oil so another reason that this is a great oil that is first is because it does have a little bit of fractionated coconut oil so it is gonna help uh, moisten the skin a little bit but you don't need a lot and again if you are feeling like you need to use a lot of fractionated coconut oil because you need to dig in you're not doing the technique the right way you just want to use a very light touch okay this is the first oil then we have lavender lavender ooh, pop lavender is the next oil that we use in the aroma touch technique okay and so we're gonna add 10 drops of lavender to our perfume bottle. Okay, just like this. And lavender is very soothing and relaxing and it promotes relaxation. Holly, I believe this is four ounces. I will double check with you. I got it on Amazon a couple years ago, but I believe it's four ounces. And so lavender is, is just soothing, it's calming, it's relaxing, and it's just, worldly known for its calming properties. So lavender is the second oil in the Aroma Touch technique. The next one is Melaleuca. Okay, this is Melaleuca. And so we're gonna add 10 drops of Melaleuca to our perfume bottle. Like so. All right. And Melaleuca is also known as tea tree oil. So if you're not familiar with um, the Latin name Melaleuca, then you might be familiar with it being called tea tree oil. And this is uh, an oil that is tremendously known for its cleansing effects. So this is also why it's in the immune boosting phase of the Aroma Touch technique. And this is really great in so many DIYs that you've seen me do in George's beard oil, in an immunity roller, in your hand cleansing blend. Melaleuca is an absolute home run and you're going to use this in so many ways. So when you have this oil, you're going to start to see all the um, really flexible ways that you can incorporate this oil into your lifestyle. And so that is Melaleuca. And then the next oil is on guard. And so we're going to add 10 drops of on guard to our perfume blend. Like so. Yes, so incredibly versatile. And on guard is, ooh, and my little ring label is popping up there. On guard is warm and fragrant, and it is also an immune boosting powerhouse with wild orange clove, cinnamon, eucalyptus, and rosemary. And another one of my life hacks that I try to explain to people is that if you run out of an oil that you use for the Aroma Touch treatment, so let's say, um, and I like to keep a separate, a completely separate set of oils. So this is why um, I, you know, cash in my points and I use my points to get things that I use all the time. I always have backups of the oils that I use for the Aroma Touch treatment. I actually always have a completely unopened Aroma Touch kit at the ready because I always want to make sure that I have these oils. But I always try to teach people if you run out of a blend, then you can make your own with the oils that are in the blend. So you can use cinnamon and eucalyptus and orange, clove and rosemary to make your own on guard if you run out of an oil that you absolutely need in the treatment. 
the next oil that we're going to use is step three and this is going to be 10 drops of the aroma touch blend and that is also known as the massage blend and it matches my nails so let's just have a moment of silence for the matchy matchy cuteness of our zoya nail polish of the week because we just love our non-toxic beauty products right so aroma touch we're going to add 10 drops of aroma touch to our perfume bottle like so yes okay and aroma touch is got all these oils that are known for soothing effects on the skin so this blend contains cypress which we use in georgia's beard oil and lots of other fun ways and for inflammation and pain and swelling and things like that peppermint which is great for also inflammation and pain marjoram which is great for snoring and sleep and any pain and all of that basil, grapefruit, and lavender. So I love that we can really tap into all of these amazing ways that we can use our oils. And actually, and I had to admit, and I told uh, my oil team this, that until I got Aroma Touch certified, which was 2017, so last November, I had already been oiling since 2014. So 2014, 2015, 2016, and almost the entire time, the entire year, the first 11 months of 2017, so four years, I did not use this oil very much at all. I completely overlooked it, exactly, Laura. It, I just, now I love it, and the smell resonates with me, and it grounds me, and I love it, but I just didn't know enough about it. I didn't really think about using it. It is such a powerhouse, and so when you're thinking about oils that you want to bring into your home and use and start incorporating into your habit architecture, you know you want to think about the value. And when you use a blend like Aroma Touch or a blend like On Guard, you're getting such a value because you're getting all the individual oils in one, in one bottle. You're getting all those beneficial oils, the marjoram and the basil and the everything. It is awesome. So Stacy, I think you're gonna really love this and. I just encourage you to start thinking about your oils in different ways, like Deep Blue and Aroma Touch. These two oils together, I love. And if you saw my scope last winter where I made a pain stick, um, I really didn't tap into using Aroma Touch until I started doing the Aroma Touch technique and really learning how it made my body feel, how calming and how soothing it really was on inflammation and pain. And so now, if I have head tension or muscle pain, I'll take Deep Blue. Uh, I'll take like a dollop of deep blue rub and mix it with a couple drops of Aroma Touch and just massage it into any painful areas and I just love it so much. So I think you're going to really love digging into Aroma Touch as it's just on its own. I love adding this to some Epsom salts and adding this to a detox bath. I love this oil and I hope that you will feel inspired to use it more. And then the next oil in step three of the Aroma Touch blend is Deep Blue. And most of us are very familiar with Deep Blue. This is the very first oil that was ever shared with me back in 2014 and it made me a believer and it made me realize, wow, if oils can do this for me, what else can they do for me? And clearly they've done a lot because we've been talking about all the things that they can do for the last three years every week together. So hmm, there's no end in sight to all the amazing things we can do with these oils. So we're gonna add 10 drops of, of Deep Blue blue to our, our uh, perfume blend. And deep blue is soothing and it's called our soothing blend. Um, Kelly loves to layer Aroma Touch and deep blue for pain and Pebby says she loves the amazing pain stick. It's amazing because it's not cooling uh, because it's not cooling. The deep blue rub is. Oh yes. Yeah, it's it's soothing. Like the Aroma Touch blend is more warm and then the deep blue rub is more cooling. And so I kind of like how those two play off of each other and help support pain. You know, because they're always saying when you have pain, you ice it and then you use heat and you ice it and you use heat. And I feel like using both of those together is just another home run. And so deep blue has an immediate tingling effect and warming effect on your skin. And it contains wintergreen, camphor, uh, peppermint, blue tansy, chamomile, heliochrysum, and osmanthus. And heliochrysum is, I think, a $60 oil, uh, and blue tansy is a $95 oil. So when we can get a bottle of deep blue for like $32 when you use your discount account, you can save so much more money than if you had to buy all those individual oils. So not that I'm saying that those other oils don't have amazing benefits individually, but to kind of get a little introduction to what heliochrysum can do for you and what blue tansy can do for you. You can experience them 
in the deep blue blend. And so this is an awesome blend and I think you're gonna love this. Now we're at the final stage four of our Aroma Touch technique with 10 drops of wild orange, okay? So wild orange is the next oil in our treatment and we're gonna add this to our perfume blend. And the citrus oils have a thinner viscosity, so that's why they come out a little bit quicker. So just definitely be aware of that. And wild orange is cold pressed from the peel of the orange, so it releases that energizing, awakening, citrusy aroma. So think of the way, like when you, I know for me, when I peel an orange and I get your, I get my thumbs in there and I just like open it up and you, you see the essence of the orange kind of spit out at you, that's what you feel inside your soul when you smell wild orange. It's, it's got that energizing aroma. And um, it just helps bring the body back to balance and it kind of wakes you up. And uh, we like to say it helps you swim to the surface. You know, when you're kind of in that zen relaxing state, you kind of like are swimming to the surface when it's time to wake up. And um, we have a chime in the zen den. And so I, I kind of like jingle the chime a little bit to kind of help you ease back to the surface, swim up from the surface. And so the invigorating and energizing smell of the wild orange really helps with that. And then the final step in the final oil in the fourth step of the Aroma Touch is peppermint. And this is invigorating. It's like an icy blast. We're going to add 10 drops of peppermint to our perfume. And this Oil of peppermint just promotes relaxation from an energy standpoint. So you're feeling energized overall, but you're feeling relaxed. You know, you're feeling in balance, but you're feeling like, okay, I'm focused, I'm energized, I'm back, I feel good. So pairing this oil with wild orange in the fourth step of the Aroma Touch technique is just a beautiful combination for bringing you back to center, bringing you back to homeostasis. Again, it's like when you're swimming to the surface of consciousness after you've been dreaming or sleeping or resting. And so it's kind of the idea of uh, if you are, if you're hearing your alarm go off, you know, it's like, okay, I'm in a deep sleep and then you've got to swim to the surface. Um, if you, if you're allergic to one of the oils, the uh, Dr. Hill's recommendation is to use frankincense in place of an oil that you are either allergic to, but I would definitely encourage you to um, dig in a little bit about the allergy because there are a lot of um, plant uh, chemistry that is not present in an essential oil when you are maybe allergic to something like lavender or peppermint, the actual, um, you know, you might be allergic to a, a chemical constituent that is not in the essential oil, like the proteins, because the proteins are distilled out of the oil. So I would definitely encourage you to maybe chat with your um, allergist or your doctor and have a skin test done and maybe have that done in a controlled environment. Um, but if you are for sure not wanting to use a particular oil or you wanna skip it, the, the recommendation from Dr. Hill is to use frankincense in place of whatever oil that you're not going to be using. Okay, and so then once we've got all eight of our oils blended into our perfume, we're going to top this with fractionated coconut. Oh, I'm sorry, we're not going to top it with fractionated coconut oil. We're going to top it with water or witch hazel. So whichever one is what you would like to choose, that's up to you. I'm going to use a funnel, so we try not to spill, but if we do, it's okay. We're going to just top this with water. And then when you wanna use it, because obviously oil and water is gonna separate, so you just wanna give it a little mix before you're gonna use it. And we're gonna save a little bit of room there at the top so that we can put in our nozzle and hopefully not overflow. And if we do, it's okay. All right, and so we're just gonna twist our nozzle right on here. Nice and tight, nice and snug. And then we put our cap on. Yes, yes, Holly, manifesting <laughs> it matches my Aroma Touch apron and so then you just give it a little zhuzh and you shake it and you can put in little lavender pods or you can put in little rose hips or whatever you want and then you just spray yourself when you're ready to smell like aroma touch and it's just so lovely 
and I'm gonna smell like I just had an aroma touch in the Zen Den, right? And you can have this with you, you can put this on your perfume shelf. Now, if you don't want to do this spray version, you can absolutely make yourself a Zen Den perfume roller bottle and do the same thing. Just add 10 drops of each oil or however many you want in a roller bottle from the Root and Petal, of course. Shout out to my girl Becky at the Root and Petal. And you can choose your own adventure and have this. You can give this as a gift. This would be a great gift to give somebody who maybe gets started with an Aroma Touch kit and comes to your home for an Aroma Touch treatment or you're giving them an Aroma Touch as a gift. Um, but I love this roller because you can harness all eight of those oils in a roller bottle the same way so this is going to have a fractionated coconut oil right and then this is going to be in a base of water and so you can just zhuzh this and mix it when you need to if you want to make this as a linen spray to spray the sheets or your pillows or your car you can make this in a larger bottle using the spray bottles from the root and petal um, again but i love the way that the perfume bottle looks and i think it's kind of chic and cool and amazon has a ton of really pretty glass perfume bottles with a little poofy thing and a little fancy thing and in any color of the rainbow so that's really fun too so um, hopefully you will enjoy this and you will see how beneficial it is to have these Aroma Touch oils at your fingertips. And again, carrying the drams with you so that you're prepared for an oil emergency whenever that might arise. And then having the roller bowl with you and using the perfume and using the spray. You want to use your oils that you invested in, right? You don't want them sitting around collecting dust. And if you ever need ideas of what to do with your oils, you can always come here to Periscope or you can come to my YouTube channel and you can see all of that and be inspired to use your oils in so many fun new ways and um, I can't wait to see if you try this how you think about it or if you are open to exploring getting Aroma Touch certified and I hope that one of you wins that really needs this set of oils because I think you're gonna love it so much and then that brings us to the end, brings us to the third segment that I wanted to talk about tonight. And that brings us to our broadcasting schedule for the upcoming year. So I've got projects I'm working on in 2019. My team is growing faster than ever before. And I wanna hold space for more self-care. I wanna hold space for balance in my life as well in 2019. And to make all of these things work well and make all of these things work in alignment, I'm shifting starting in January from four periscopes a month to two periscopes per month. And most of the time, these will be every other week. Um, but when there are holidays or family birthdays or travel back to back, um, it will allow me to hold more space for my creative process and hold space for my growing team and for my leaders, as well as my precious family time. And so each month there will be two Periscope broadcasts and this will allow me more flexibility to play around with maybe randomly popping into Periscope, perhaps on the first of the month, to share with you the new oils and the new promotions um, and to share BOGO promotions with you that happen three times a year. So those are uh, February, usually the last uh, sometime in the late parts of February and then in July and then in December um, or in November I'm sorry so in November when the the BOGOs are announced um, that will be a really great opportunity for me to pop in and share with you by having that extra space in my schedule a little bit so that I can kind of do those random things and um, other special doTERRA news that crops up I'm gonna still be here on Periscope to share that with you so that'll be kind of new because normally um, when I kind of pop in randomly for things it's on Instagram live or Facebook live and I want to do a little bit more of that flexibility here with Periscope so I'm still gonna do two broadcasts per month and um, especially when the first of the month falls on a Thursday it's very challenging because you know the early parts of the morning I'm jumping into all the live media to share with everybody what the new oils are and then that night I'm doing a periscope and that's a lot of live media that's like six videos in one day and that's a lot for anybody and there's only so many oils that you can use right before you just need to take a step back and say I need a little bit of balance so that I can bring my best creativity to the table and so um, that's gonna be really helpful for me so it's not gonna be so overwhelming that there's five videos in all the the vortex is right on one day it's going to be spaced out a little bit better so it may seem effortless for you watching um that maybe these broadcasts just magically appear and they're just here accidentally but i assure you and i promise you and my family knows um they can attest to that that it takes hours and hours and days and the whole week really is spent preparing for these and it takes lots of frankincense and copaiba to put these demos together and it is such a joy of my heart and i don't ever want to lose that and 
um, you know, experimenting with recipes, bringing the recipes to you that are awesome and that I've really truly tested and that I know that they work and that I use them in my home, um, you know, making sure I don't forget materials, that the information that I am sharing with you is valuable, that you are using your precious time in a valuable way to watch the content that I'm sharing with you, to prepare everything, then wrap everything up, uh, ensuring all the information is archived for you and that you can retrieve it years from now. Like it is, it is really a beast and it's an amazing, amazing gift and I love it. Uh, and I want to make sure that I am continuing to do that in the way that serves all of our highest good with my creativity and holding space for all the things, right? Plus the mentor calls, the welcome calls for new Oilers, the follow-up calls, making sure that I'm still supporting all of the people that have invested in me. Super, super important. Yes, Joe, that is an excellent question. All the little pop-up periscopes will be archived to YouTube, just like everything. It is so awesome and I love this so much and it truly makes me feel like this is my purpose and I don't ever wanna give that up. And so in order to do that, I need to make sure that everything in my life is balanced and that's what I teach in my mentor calls and all the welcome calls and in my business leader support calls that I do and all these other things that are peripheral that um, are behind the scenes for running my business and supporting a global team. All of those things need equal attention. And so um, I am working on my own self-care and holding space for my own personal growth too. And I think this is a really happy medium, again, that's gonna serve everybody's highest good. And I could not be more excited about it. And I'm so grateful for your support. And that means in January, I will see you two times, one on January 10th, and then again on January 24th. So every month on the first, I will let you know the schedule for that month for the Periscope um, broadcast schedule. So you will know, you'll still get the teaser post um, on the morning of the evenings that I'm gonna be doing my Periscope, so you'll know exactly what we're talking about. You'll know exactly when there's gonna be a Periscope, so you'll never have to wonder. And I'm still here in all the vortexes. If you're plugged into my private oil team page or our public oil community page on Facebook, if you're not plugged in there, definitely um, friend me on Facebook and send me a message that you wanna be plugged into the oil community page there and I'd be happy to do that. And on Instagram and all of the things, all the vortexes. So we covered a lot of ground tonight. I have worked over the last few months to set my intentions for the year ahead and really get clear and very detailed on how I wanna achieve my goals and the action steps needed to do that. And so I hope that you will take some time between now and the new year to reflect on the things in your life that you can truly commit to following through with and things that you can streamline and things that you can improve and things that you can work on and make them better. And yes, on weeks when we're not live, you can totally catch up because there's 179 broadcasts now after this where if you missed anything, you can totally catch up. And I love leveling up with you and showing you that you don't need an excuse to use your oils. Um, you don't need an excuse to practice mindfulness and you don't need an excuse to share these oils in new ways with people close to you. But if you do, Aroma Touch is an amazing way to do that. So I would love for you to reach out to me if you are ready to purchase essential oils and want my support and my leadership. I've got a $92 frankincense for you when you get started with my favorite Aroma Touch, uh, my favorite home essentials kit uh, this month. And I have a welcome bundle for you and this deal will last until midnight on Monday. Um, but if you wanna get started with a smaller kit, this is the top eight oils. So the home essentials kit is my favorite. It's the most popular. It's the top 10 with a diffuser, but this is also my second most popular, which is the top eight. And it also does come with the diffuser too. So when you get started with the starter kit version, you can get that as well. So this is gonna be really special for you. When you get started with me, you're also going to get the Essential Life book because as always, I want you to have all of the information at your fingertips at any time of day. And um, you'll have all access to all of the broadcasts, all the recipes, all the research, all the replays from classes and workshops and tutorials, resources that I've archived all the way back from 2014 to now. I cannot wait to bring you in to my oily world. And I am just so grateful for you. Thank you for always holding space for me each week. That is a wrap on my 179th Periscope broadcast. I can't believe it because I feel like there's so many things I wanna share. There's so many ideas. There's so many recipes I've got. I've just got post-its galore. I've got notes to myself and all the little notebooks of things that I wanna share with you. 
So I'm gonna finish my magnesium mocktail. I'm gonna clean up. I'm gonna do all the steps that it takes me to get everything done and wrapped up for the night. And then by 11 p.m., I am gonna be sharing the winner of the Aroma Touch Kit. I am so excited to see who's gonna win. I will see you in two weeks on January 10th. Be sure that you comment on my Instagram post with your favorite Periscope that I've done so far. Tag a friend for an extra entry. All of that ends at 10 p.m. Eastern so that I have time to put everything in a randomizer and let you know who's gonna win. And I love you all so much. I'm wishing you the happiest, healthiest new year. And I really hope that it involves the Aroma Touch technique in 2019 for you. And I would love for you to share with me on Instagram or Periscope or Facebook or wherever you wanna go and share. If you try the technique, if you look it up in the book and you get gritty and you, you give it a try, I just cannot wait to see how it helps serve you and your family's health and wellness in 2019. So I am so grateful for you all. Cheers to three years. It's been amazing. I'm so blessed by all of you. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the new year.